I have a partial graded Morgan dollar set, a complete peace dollar set. Most of them are mint state and another, which is not complete, but it has most of the better dates or at least the better dates. Some of them are clean and some of them are not peace dollar set. I'm going to show you the Morgan dollar set and PCGS has this valued at over $24,000. About $24,642 is the actual high retail. What I'm going to do is to lower it from the retail and then we're going to have a sale on all of our silver dollars, 5% off. So when it, we get all these up on the site, get everything listed, they're going to run that sale. Some of these are exceptional coins. There are some really rare ones, but there are coins for everybody's budget. So we're going to take a look at these coins. I, I wish I still had all of them, but unfortunately I did break it up a little bit. I sold to a few local customers. We have a couple people who are trying to fill their Morgan dollar collections and they asked me if I had the date. I can't tell them I don't have them. I, I can't tell them. I didn't want to sell all of these, but they have to go. We have to sell our inventory. That's why we buy it. So let's get started. In this video, we're going to just look at the obverse of these coins for the most part. Uh, you, they're pretty much pieces just greatest, so they are what they are. But you have all these really nice coins in this holder. And like I said before, I hated to break these up. But look at these coins. I mean, this is a 78cc Mint State 64, a 78s Mint State 65, and a 79cc and very fine 30. I mean, just... This collection someone put together, it was sent off for grading, but the, at first it was not graded. And that's why some of them are genuine. The person that sent them off wasn't completely familiar with grading, 80cc and extra fine 40, but they really got some good ones regardless. And of course, you know, the reverse is pretty much the same. Like I said, we're not going to look at the reverses. The 8263, 82cc, very fine 35, 83s, extra fine 45. An 83cc, it got very fine details. What I do is I take the very fine 20 grade, the lowest very fine, take a discount off of it, and then you're going to get 5%. So 84cc, very fine 25. A lot of people look for these. You don't see these graded very often. 85s and 89o and 84s, extra fine 45. A lot of people put them up like this. They'll dip them out and put them up as AU. Unfortunate people do that. They do that with those that like the 83S as well and the 96O. You see that a lot. They'll even put AUs up that are cleaned and tout them as AU58 or even Mint State 60. And here is a perfect example of some of those dates that are they do that with is an AU53, an 86O, got an 86S, 87O, extra fine 45, 87O, extra fine 40. See, those are all the, the types that in the higher grades, these or condition rarities. In other words, they will go up in value the higher they grade in the 88S, San Francisco Mint, and also your O Mints. They, those are two that are known for that because they circulated uh, out west. 89CC, very good 10. To find an 89CC that actually looks the grade and is problem free, that is very difficult. It's hard for me to discount this one because you just don't see these very often. 89O, Scratch, 90CC, AU Details. That's a nice details coin, even though they considered it clean. That's one of them that doesn't look cleaned. It probably is somewhere, but I just, I didn't really look at it that close, but it looks really nice for a clean coin. 91 and 91CC. As you can see, a lot of problem-free coins that are better. 92, extra fine 45, 91S, extra fine details. And that one looks clean, as you can see. It looks a little different than this one. This one almost looks like this one. Pretty close. AU50, 91.0, 92cc, very fine 30, 92o, and a 92s. Really good coins. This one really jumps, man. When it gets up to the high grade, you can see 600 bucks. And extra fine 45, it even goes even higher. And AU, it's just out of this world. It really jumps. It's always good to know that. Used to, you'd be able to find some and, and buy them. Uh, online for a good price anymore. Everybody knows it. This 93, I mean, it's a Mint State 62, $2,300, but man, this coin is all the grade and maybe even the 63. They just, and if you could see it there, it's just not beat up like most 62s. 
93cc. I did have the 93S, and we had the 94S, 94 um, O's right here, and the 95S. We still are the we still have the 94S here, and we have the 95 and the 94S. But we had the 95O. We had every one of them. But you can see the 97S extra fine 45, 94O extra fine 45. And the 94S is AU53. That's a good one there. And 95S is another one. Very fine uh, 25. You can see how rare it is even in that low grade. Very fine 25 is a pretty good grade, though. Some of these are, I mean, most of these are affordable for most people. If you're collecting these, you want to buy the better dates. I know the Mint State 62 93 is a little expensive. 960 AU55, this is another one. I searched and searched on eBay from the beginning. This is one of my favorite years because it's not a well-struck coin. It doesn't have great luster. And when you can find a really nice problem-free example, those go for a premium. And AU and up, it really jumps in AU58 to AU55. Probably better than some AU58s I've seen. This one here is a 96S, very fine, uh, 30. 97O, AU55. There's another O mints. There's your S mints, AU55, uh, 98S, uh, 98O, which is common date, 97S, extra fine, 45, another one. 99 is, uh, it's ump details, 99O, 65, that's a nice 65. And then you have a 99S, which is one of the better dates uh, in higher grades. San Francisco, and 99062, 1900S, AU58, 19010, AU58. This one's a biggie. This one's a solid AU58. A lot of times you'll see an AU58, and it doesn't look the grade. And we can flip it over here. And you can see it has all the breast feathers, really nice, just a little bit of rub. Has some silver rub, probably from where it was inside the bag at one time. It's never been touched. Completely original. It's a good one to get. It really jumps in 60. 19010, 01S, another S mint that's a little better in the higher grades. Uh, 1902, 1903, 02S and 63. A little darker, but expensive coin in that grade. And then an 020. Then we do have the famous 030s that used to be crazy prices at one time, but they found a hoard of them and they came down in price over the years. Uh, 03065, but that's still a valuable coin in that grade. 03S, another good one, 775, an extra fine 40. 04 is a better one, but with it being cleaned and very fine details, it's not that much, $50 on that. Uh, your 04 is common, really nice to see those struck really well with the full breast feathers. A lot of weak strikes in the O-mints. 04S, another better one in condition grade. So there you have it. There's uh, the Morgan Dollar Collection valued by PCGS at over $24,642. And I will be selling it for less than that once the discounts happen and, and we give the coupon. So I hope you enjoyed this video and like the coins. And like I said, if there's any of them that you want, go over to PortsmouthCoinShop.com and check out our sale that we're having and take advantage of it. You won't be disappointed. These coins are, you know, really nice. A lot of nice coins. It's, a lot of better dates and key dates, uh, condition grade coins, and some common dates. Plus all the other silver dollars we have up. We have ungraded silver dollars as well. 5% off, $65. That's a good deal on mint state, BU, or at least uncirculated coins. Guaranteed uncirculated, guaranteed brilliant uncirculated. You will not get an AU slider coin if we tell you it's mint state 60 and up. So thanks for watching and have a great day.